my boy Chris. What's up? There's someone else in the back, but they don't want to be in the video. And we just saw the movie Dark Phoenix. And it's pretty much a retelling of the Dark Phoenix movie. I mean, the Dark Phoenix comic. And Jean Grey gets the Phoenix and she goes crazy. And you want to give your opinion because this movie has been getting a lot of bad rep. And he's a he's a, few, a huge X-Men fan. He loves X-Men. So maybe he'll feel I mean, different than what regular people will feel. It's definitely not as bad as everybody was making it out to be. But like the story was like the consistencies of the story was pretty bad. Some characters were missing. Um, but the, like, if you just like seeing superhero movies and seeing like superheroes and villains fighting, it's a pretty good movie to watch. How would you compare the villains in this movie? Are they like rememberable? Not really. No, Jean Grey was the the main villain, really. Yeah, and like the acting was good and stuff. Uh, Sophie Turner, she uh, did good in a role. A couple times she was like that, but besides that, I liked it. Man. And Michael Fassman, he was my favorite part in the whole time movie. I really liked that movie. He he did a good part there. The, the bad thing about the movie though is they didn't have Quicksilver in the movie at all. And he's my favorite character, but they didn't really have him in the movie for like five minutes. Yeah, and then like, it's not really a spoil alert because you've seen it in the trailer, but you know they kill Mystique in there. And that's pretty much the only, that's the only death in the movie, let's be honest. Yeah, that's it's really the only, the only thing that actually like, made They showed it in the trailer, so you like, why, why do I care? Like you already knew she was gonna die, they just didn't show her like the impact actually happened, but you like, Okay, I wish they didn't do that. That was kind of... Well, really, you already know what's going to happen, but they really just make the movie to like portray it in a different way. I guess you just see the movie to see it portrayed in a different way than it was told before. Yeah, and then like, uh, compared to the adaption of the uh, comic, it's not really... It's a little more faithful than the third one, but it still didn't really do that justice, in my opinion. It was a smaller scale and everything, and then the X-Men get captured again, and like, how many movies have they even captured in? Basically everyone. <laughs> they get captured again, and then this time, you must love them. I didn't like... And then they start hating them. You, you know, just, I don't know. Then they don't, you don't really even have to see the other movies to really, because they don't acknowledge the other yeah, movies. Yeah, it doesn't really have anything to do with the other movies. <laughs> because imagine if someone watched uh, the other ones to be ready for this. They're going to be kind of confused. I'm like, wait a minute, I thought... Because like Angel, he's like we don't even know what happened to Angel. There's a couple yeah. characters in this. And they, Psylocke was supposed to be in it too. Yeah, and they changed um, Jean Grey's origin story. Yeah, one. because she, did she have the Phoenix in the last movie? Now she had. Yeah, it was. It wasn't as bad as the people. It was kind of. It was really. It wasn't. It wasn't for like comic book fans. It was just for people that like to see some cool stuff in the movie. Yeah, and if like you, you're already a fan of X Men, I mean, might as well see it's the last one. So, and there's no post credit scene because Disney owns it now. They're gonna reboot it, so it doesn't even get your point. But for this to be the last X Men movie, and the X Men started pretty much all the superhero stuff, it was a big it's kind of yeah, it's kind of a big letdown. So, if you've seen a uh, fan of X Men, I guess see it. But it's not much after this. That's it. We'll yeah, see. X-Men. We'll see X Men in probably like six years. You think Disney will probably wait six something years? And then they'll try because to... I I want to see what they do with it, but. Yeah, it'll probably be about but Yeah. It'll probably be a lot better soon, hopefully. I guess see it. I mean it's it's there. Yeah. Yeah. Kinda in the middle. In the middle. Well you think this is better than Apocalypse then? No. Uh, Loki? No. I don't even know why I was trying to compare <laughs> <Yeah>. it to Loki. <laughs> Alright guys, peace, peace out. out.